Okay, this is a shader for the Legacy Vertex Lit Rendering Path in Unity. So if you look at your player settings under other settings, the rendering path isn't set to forward, which is the default. It's set to Legacy Vertex Lit because I want to use the Vertex Lit Lighting Engine. So I have my scene set up and I have a baked light, which is the sun in this case. And I also have a point light that is a real-time light. And I want the real-time light to, to uh, of course, have real-time lighting. It's going to be moving or flickering. Um, but I want to also have some realistic shadows with the baked lighting. So if I bake the lighting right now, what's going to happen? Uh, because the shader that I'm using is the mobile vertex lit shader. So what's going to happen is the lighting's going to bake and we're going to get the shadows and the uh, the the real time light is going to stop working on the surface. And that's that's for 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 what I want to do that's not that great. I want to have uh, I want to have the realistic shadows, but I also want to have this light light up the scene yeah, when it goes by and I want this real time light to work. So that's where this shader comes in. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to select the cube and the plane. And I'm going to change the shader to custom vertex dynamic light map. That's the shader included here. And this shader allows exactly that. We have the bake lighting. But it also responds... To the dynamic light so this might work work really good for uh you know maybe a flashlight or a torch um maybe you have a torch on the wall uh, and uh you want to bake the lighting so there's realistic shadows but you also want to have that torch flicker um and and you can see that light flicker um or any case where you want to have the legacy vertex lit engine you want to bake your lighting to get those realistic shadows uh, but you also want to have dynamic lights work on those vertices i know i was looking for uh, for this shader for an effect like this and i couldn't find it so i hope the shader helps you out thanks for checking it out guys